anyone who's running the Chester Marathon tomorrow, the very best of luck to you. This is my first marathon. I've done 13 half marathons, but I've never done the biggie, the big enchilada tomorrow I am doing. I am not nervous. Oh no, far from it. I'm going to sail through. That's what you do, you see. If you believe you can, you just do it. That's what you do. We're not here for a long time, we're here for a good time. So if you're running it, get some fire in your belly. Come on, have it, have it. Chester Marathon, here we come. I am not nervous. Look at the face of me, not nervous. Chester Marathon, 26.2 miles. I know you do it. Not here for a long time, we're here for a good time. Over and out. Here we go. Fortune favours the brave. Chester Half Marathon. Come on. I don't know what worried is. Worried? Going really slowly. I'll let you know how we get on later. Catching a bit. Three mile stage, and I feel absolutely fine. Lots of people running here. Beautiful day for a run. All in all, I'm glad it popped out. See you later. Okay. Pain. Do you know what pain is? Pain is fear leaving the body. Oh yeah, I've just passed five miles. I don't feel no pain. I feel gain. That's what I feel, gain. There's no confusion in my mind. When you know you're gonna do something, you'll do it. Yeah. Five miles. So let's do the maths here. About 21 miles to go. 21 miles to go. Well, I've done 13 times 13.1 miles. So, in all truth, I should sail by. I should cruise through. I'm currently standing to come in at about 5 hours 30. But look at the scenery. Amazing. And look at these guys. SP Energy Networks Cancer Research. People making a difference with attitude. Attitudes are contagious. Is yours worth catching? I love that quote. Okay, it's mile 10. I'm feeling A okay. And uh, something like 16 miles to go. So that's all good. Beautiful day for a bit of a run, to be honest with you. Beautiful day. Attitudes are contagious, is yours worth catching?
Okay, I've just passed 12 miles and I'm feeling just fine. Never better. What a beautiful day. Uh, my knees are a little bit sore. But all in all, just what the doctor ordered. What a great way to enjoy the back end of the summer as the leaves fall from the, the trees. That's what's behind me. That's what's in front of me. These are legs that are doing it. And boy, I'd like one of these houses, please. If God's up there right now, I could do with a bit of a lift. Let up a, try to pay off my mortgage. All in all, though, it's about what you do with your life that's important. Yeah, man. I can hear some music. It's time for a bit of a jiggy. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you how it's going to be. That's a mighty that's gonna cross the finishing line, you see. Rhythms in my body at the back of my brain, stopping me from going overboard and beginning me soon. Yeah. Do you have a rest of the way? Catch you soon. I've got a body to respect, a mind and a soul. A brain that stops deep in the race from slipping down holes. And I've always had the patience to make some very long rolls. I spend a lot of time in low-down bars, but look, I'm still here and there's no scars. The proof of the puddings in the drinking of the jars. Okay, you can find this video at Can You See on Underlanders of Night Now. This is Jane and this is Mo. Hi. And, they, Hi. and they have kept me company in perhaps one of the most laborious parts of the race. But now it just feels like a bit of a walk in the park. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. How are you feeling, girls? Great. Yes, are you? Great. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to do yeah. this. Yeah. Gonna get, uh, the cake. I, this is a piece of cake now. Yeah. Just a piece of cake, and the cake is fudge cake. Yeah. With the uh, heart with ice cream. Yes. At the end, please. Yes. Okay. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to get back to you when we towards the end. <laughs> You'll recognise me. I, I look like I'm just not nervous about anything. <laughs> and this is another big road. Yeah. So catching a bit. Okay. It's 21 miles. 21 miles the furthest I've ever run in my life, thank God. If pain is fear leaving the body, at this stage, I would like it to leave just a fraction quicker. But other than that, I've got two strong legs and I still believe that attitudes are contagious is yours worth catching. This is the furthest I've ever run. And if you've never done this, and if you've never entered a race, I suggest you do it. Because all I can think about is the fulfillment at the end of this journey. You don't get no dress rehearsals in life. This is it. This is your life. So come on. Let's push the boundaries a bit. Two weeks ago, I did the Warrington Half Marathon, and now I'm doing a marathon. A lot of people said, what are you doing running a race so quickly after the last one, which was 13 and a half miles? And my answer to that is, that's prep. It's prep, innit? We're northern, it's prep. Yes, I'm gonna do this. I am going to do this. Catch you in a bit. Okay, I'm with Chloe. Hello. <laughs> She's just in the first uh, marathon. And he saved me. <laughs> yeah. And I, no, I was saved. At the 24th mile. <laughs> and uh, we are so close to finishing. We reckon we've got about two miles, is it? No, we've got one mile. Have we? Yeah. One mile. Wow. Fabulous. Perfect. Thank you. And we are not walking, we are running. No, we're going to run past that line. Yes, because fortune favours the brave. <laughs> fortune favours the brave. And none the braver. None the braver. <laughs>
So that's it for Scammersdale. Yay! That's it for Warrington. Yay! <laughs> Catch you in a bit. <laughs> Hi, this is the end of the 26.2 miles. It's all done, all done and dusted, thank God. And I've only got one thing to say pain is fear leaving the body. Over and out, there goes Warrington. 26.2 miles, the biggest race I've ever done. Furthest I've ever run at the oldest age I've ever been. Finished?